啦啦啦啦啦啦啦啦啦。Warm ups. Hi everyone, it's Raja and Raven, and you're watching this week's episode of RuPaul's Drag Race Fashion Photo Review. We are going to be tooting and rooting the looks from the main stage, season 15 of. I love makeover challenge, and this one actually, in particular, because they get to make over teachers. Teachers are some of the hardest working professionals in the world,、mm -hmm. and、uh, what better way to give back to them than with the art, beauty, and fun and joy of drag? And don't forget, you can catch an all-new episode of RuPaul's Drag Race season 15 Fridays on MTV. And if you live outside of the U.S., Canada, or Australia, you can watch on Wow Presents. Plus, and here I am schooling the kids as well,、mm -hmm. baby. We are educators ourselves. We are. My entire high school career is based on the support and love of all of my teachers. I think my teachers saw more in me than I saw in myself, and they were there to support me and guide me through high school. It, it, without my teachers, I wouldn't have made it. So I'm really excited to see this. I hope that the girls do a good job. No f's given. We're going to be tuning and booting the queens and their teacher, and of course. Like always,、mm -hmm. family resemblance. Right. Which means your makeover needs to look almost just the same. Category is drag family resemblance. What is your right way? First to the stage, we bring Sasha Colby and Ferocity Colby.、Mm, damn. They look great. Sasha looks like she's going. Hee, look what I did. <laughs> This is March Banks. Looks beautiful. She looks、mm -hmm. amazing. The paint is beautiful. The hairstyle is beautiful. And then to give her that Hawaiian touch because Sasha is Hawaiian,、mm -hmm. it's beautiful. And I love that it's the same, but there's little differences. I love the island touch to it. I love that kind of tropical blend of colors: the pinks, the yellows, the oranges, but mostly the pink. The hair texture is really lovely to me too. I just love that kind of. Fuzz fullness and、mm -hmm. the florals. You know, I love a little floral in the hair once in a while. I just think they look so beautiful. I think Sasha's done a really fantastic job. I think they look like sisters. They look related to each other, which is the challenge. We want family resemblance. Simple for Sasha, but still looks good. Toot, toot. Next, we bring to the stage Lucy Laduca and Lala Laduca. I love that. All four of these pieces look like they could be on four hangers in a closet, and you could grab any two of them and wear them together.、Mm -hmm. That little jacket that Lucy's wearing could、mm -hmm. go right on Lala's and look like one piece. This is definitely one of my favorite makeover looks that I've ever seen. To be honest with you, I just love how well everything is kind of constructed. Now, is it like crazy, spectacular, high fashion? Like I really kind of want things to be? No, but it's very much Lucy Laduca. It's a Nipton waist, and she's got this sort of classic. Stepford wifey、mm -hmm. kind of vibe to her, so it's very, very consistent. I think the family resemblance is uncanny. They look like they would definitely be hanging out together. I love the color combination. I love all the different primaries. I love the brightness of it. I love the print. I think they look good. Yeah, it's a nice clean makeover too. You can see that Lucy has the way she paints.、Mm -hmm. That's the way it is.、Mm -hmm. It's stamped on there,、mm -hmm. and that's her go-to.、Mm -hmm. There's nothing wrong with it, but she took that and she put it right onto Mrs. Wallace or、mm -hmm. Lala Laduca. Yeah, I wish Lala's hair was a little fuller though. See how Lucy's got like that nice like height to it、mm -hmm. and separation. I would have liked to see that on Lala. It's a good makeover, and I do like the pieces because I would wear these. I love what Lucy Laduca is wearing. It's a two, two. Next, we bring to the stage Mistress Isabel Brooks and her family member. Madame Thang, oh yeah, Jarag. The hair, the makeup, the jewelry, the nails, the boas, the gown—it's just—it's all drag from top to bottom. Is it super exciting? No, but it's clean. It's nice. It's beautiful. And there are two completely realized looks.、Mm -hmm. They don't really look like sisters. Right. I think they look like friends. I mean, she did the job. Miss Tang is serving. There's a. Certain cheekiness about Mistress Isabel Brooks' drag.、Mm -hmm. She's a drag queen. She comes from Houston. She works at the clubs、mm -hmm. and does old school drag. She also does a little bit of campiness here and there, and has fun with it. I give it a toot. It's a toot for me. 
Next, we bring to the stage Lux Noir London and Asia Azul. Asia Azul looks mm -hmm. pretty. I like the makeup.、Mm -hmm. I like how fierce it is. I like how striking it is. It just kind of stops there. They definitely do not look like family members. No, not at all. And there's a huge disconnect between the two.、Mm -hmm. It's the peachiness with no hints of blue. I don't see any hints of blue.、Mm. I'm not a huge fan. The styling on this is off for me. If you were giving someone a makeover and the idea was that you look similar to each other, wouldn't you do something to your own look and modify it a little bit to kind of help the other, you know, the, the less experienced? Yeah. Why wear the midriff bearing thing? When your sister can't, you know what、mm -hmm. I'm saying, or not that she can't, but she isn't. You、yeah. know, the two silhouettes of the of the outfits are totally different. The colors are often different. The hair color is like there's nothing that says they're related or even know each other. They're not even at the same party. One of them is at a disco party. The other one's at like a toga party. This is a boot. This is a boot as well for me. Next, we bring to the stage Anitra and Electra. Mrs. Mahoney is a pocket sized. Anitra. I think they look adorable. Mrs. Mahoney or Electra looks adorable.、Mm -hmm. I think that hair on her looks great.、Mm -hmm. I think that the bodysuit fits her well.、Mm -hmm. It's a good makeover. I don't like this hair on Anitra. The proportion of it is kind of weird. There needs to be more hair on top. Mm -hmm. And that little knot just kind of throws it off. My eye is just going to that. You know that hairstyle has been going around for a while now. It's been for a few years, and you know we see it on Instagram. We see it on the Dashians. Just because they're wearing it doesn't mean it translates onto a drag head. It should be bigger. It just looks crazy on her. Yeah, you're right. I mean, it's a bodysuit, one leg. Two different tones, kind of yin and yang,、mm -hmm. and then this sash that comes off the wrist wraps around the body and down the leg. Nice little touch. I like it. Again, clean makeover. I think they look great. Not totally groundbreaking, and sometimes there's just not enough room or time to do anything that's just crazy spectacular on these makeover challenges. So, like you said, clean makeup looks great. Hair's fine. Outfit's cute. Yin and yang. Love it all. And Mrs. Mahoney looks like she's feeling herself.、Mm -hmm. I love Mrs. Mahoney. She's gorgeous. It's a toot. It's a toot for me. Trend, Trend alert. alert! Teachers. Teachers. Educators. Some love. Yes. To Mentors. All the if you are still in school right now, or even if you're not, if you still talk to one of your teachers, send them a message, a note, a text, and just let them know, hey, thank you. Our top two of the week is. Lucy, Lucy and La 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 Duca. Yes, Lucy and La La. La La and Lucy. Work teachers. I was going to say work <laughs> teachers. <laughs> One more episode until the reunion, and then the finale where we crown a winner, baby. Winner. Yes. Okay. Bye. Bye.